Morning. Have uh, we got a meeting today? Not unless you've scheduled something, no. Don't think so. Oh, well, there's that new contract to go through with Mr Lewis, but I can handle that. <laughs> what would I do without you? Mr Lewis just got back to me and he's agreed to take the 5%. Is that right? Yeah. You know, I know it's not a massive contract, but I still can't believe that he agreed. I told you to call the whole thing off. Oh, I thought that was just a threat to make him sign the contract. It was my decision, which you chose to ignore. Oh, I didn't think that you meant it. Then you should have asked me first, before going off and doing your own thing. You're treating this business like you're in charge. Kim, you were really excited about this deal. Don't you remember? Like, I think you're just, you're just getting confused. No, no, no. Not this time. I know exactly what's going on. What do you mean? There's money missing from the Hop account. Is there? <laughs> don't play the innocent with me. Well, if there is, I, I don't know anything about it. Maybe it's just a mistake. I've been through the supplier list. And the payments don't relate to any of them, which means someone's been stealing. And I know exactly who. Do you want to explain how you can afford this lot? You went in my room. I was curious. The shoes, the attitude. I had to confirm my suspicions and you made it easy for me. I mean, <laughs> it's all there. All the proof I need. You went on a shopping spree with my money. I can't believe you're accusing me. I should never have trusted you. Why would I steal from you? After everything you've done for me? Deny all you like. I can see it on your face. You're as guilty as hell. No! Fine. I'll phone the police. They'll get the truth out of you. Uh, no, I, I don't think you want to do that. Oh, I definitely do. What, do you want everyone to know that you're ill? Are you threatening me? No. No, of course not. I'm, I'm trying to protect you. Because you gave me that money. The other day, I, I was upset because I didn't have anything else to wear. And you were really nice about it. You know, you gave me the cash. Told me to treat myself. I, I wouldn't have done that. You don't remember? And even if I did, it doesn't explain the missing money. Someone was dipping into the business account. Well, it wasn't me. How could it have been? I, I don't have the passwords. Well, it had to be you. There's no-one else it can be. Kim, I didn't want to tell you this. I've been trying to protect you, but... You took that money. I saw you paying invoices the other day. I know you don't want to believe it, but... You made those payments. <laughs> I wouldn't do that. You really don't remember? I don't remember half what's happening to me. It's getting worse. I'm sorry for accusing you, Gabby. I got it all wrong. Don't worry. It's OK. I I'll make sure the money's paid back. Thank you. I'm always so careful when I make payments. I double-check them every time. Well, you must have been distracted. Oh, is that what we're calling it now? You keep getting confused. But I've told you, I'm going to sort it. I don't want anyone finding out. They won't. This is just between us. You can trust me with anything. Here. Drink this. Thanks. I'll have it later. I'm going for a lie down. A stinking headache. Oh. 
Doctor, it's Kim Tate. Yeah, I know my bloods came back clear, but something's still not right. I keep forgetting more and more stuff. I think I'd better have a, a proper dementia test. <laughs>